What's happening everyone? Bienvenidos, welcome back to my channel. Hit that subscribe button, join the family. Today I wanted to share this tip with all of you. It's quite simple. However, when I was doing a live with NARS on their page, I shared this tip and everyone went wild. They were crazy about it. They were like, oh my God, this is the best tip ever. So I thought today I would show you how I prevent my lower mascara on my lower lashes from transferring underneath my eyes. I have extremely long lower lashes. If you watch my tutorials, you have probably noticed. However, they do not transfer underneath my eyes. My main tip, I have three within this video, but it's still gonna be a quick video. Um, one is to use a waterproof brown black mascara. It looks way more natural on your lower lashes. I know sometimes for me, a really deep, dark black mascara can look a little intense on my lower lashes. This looks natural, it's waterproof, it's brown black, so it's a lot more forgiving on the lower lashes and waterproof is just bound to move around less than a typical mascara, like this one. This is the one I used during the live. This is not sponsored. This is the NARS Climax Extreme Mascara and it is extreme. It is the blackest mascara I own. It is thick, uh, volumizing. I mean, it is a very luscious mascara and I would never ever think to use a mascara like this on my lower lashes unless I apply accordingly. So get out your pen and paper, take some notes. I'm gonna show you guys, first of all, when you take out your mascara, wipe off the excess. If you are in the middle of applying your mascara, I would just use whatever mascara is left over from your upper lashes on your lower lashes. I'm going in fresh here because I've already done my upper mascara. So take off the excess and then you wanna flip your brush vertically when applying your lower lash mascara instead of doing this. This is the most common way I see people applying mascara on their lower lashes. They go like this. And what that does is it coats the lashes from the root all the way to the tip. If you have really long lashes, if there's mascara on the very tip of your lashes, it's just going to transfer all up in that concealer that you worked so hard to set to get to not crease to highlight, it's a mess. Comment down below if you've been there when your mascara has transferred underneath your eyes and you've already set your concealer, there's powder there, you've color corrected, it is an absolute nightmare. So this tip is very important. If you do wanna use a mascara you already have and love and do still want very lush looking lower lashes, don't wanna buy another mascara, Hold your mascara wand vertically. And the way you're gonna apply your mascara on your lower lashes is by just wiggling the mascara at the roots. So you're at the root, like the base of the lash to the middle. By doing this, you're keeping all of the mascara closest to the lash line and the base. You're still making them look full. You're still getting that full payoff from that mascara that you love but you're not getting it on the tip of your lashes. Bam, okay, so now that you have this here, what you wanna do is grab a clean spoolie brush. You think I'd be prepared for this video. Have a clean spoolie brush, this is tip number three. You're gonna go from underneath, remove any excess dog fur on your spoolie brush. You're gonna go from underneath and you're gonna lift. This is, of course, gonna lift the lashes so they're not physically touching your under eye, but it's also removing any excess mascara that might be underneath the lashes at the very tip, and also, in return, it's gonna help to prevent that transfer underneath your eyes. Um, one additional tip, if you love a facial mist like I do, I live for a facial mist. I consider it an essential in your makeup routine. I've said this before, definitely mist before you go in with your final touches. So brow gel, um, upper lashes, lower lashes, lipstick, mist so that all the skin product gets melted in, but not your mascara. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the other side and that is a wrap on this video. <sighs> and scene, I can breathe anytime I apply a lower mascara. I'm like, please. Don't transfer underneath my eyes until I'm completely done. Give this video a like, guys. It really helps me out. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. 
share it with anyone who would enjoy hearing this tip if you um, like that this video series is back i promise to keep it up it is a very quick video for me to shoot and edit and um, get up for you guys i know i've been slacking um, if you haven't seen the news, LA has been going through a heat wave, so it makes it really, really, really difficult to film under hot lights when uh, when my 1924 California bungalow still does not have central air. It is very hot. You could probably cook an egg on my table. So I really appreciate the love. Subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah. Peace.